What's up, folks? Welcome back to Beyblader Burst. I'm your host, Michael Nightwing, and today we're unboxing or unbagging Prom Apocalypse. We got Prom Apocalypse here, and uh, yeah, let's just get to it. Let's get to it. So, so as you see, it didn't come in a box, it just came directly in a bag. But uh, you know, it is what it is with the instructions here. So that's cool because I also got, if you saw the last video, Genesis, Regalia Genesis, but I didn't have any instructions. But it's cool that this one came with instructions. So maybe it'll offer instructions for Genesis. Yeah, it looks like, uh, okay, it does. So like, did these two come in like a pack together or something? Like, uh, like some type of like booster double pack or something? Yeah, let me know. I'm, I don't know how these two were packaged, but whatevs. Whatevs. One, I don't know what these one. All right, whatever. So let's set this aside and let's get to the opening of this bad boy here. So, of course, in the anime, Arthur, uh, Paragraphs, gets bodied numerous times later on. So we got stickers. Uh, not going to be using those. Set those aside. Yeah. And then we got the disc, which is zero. Now, this part here, right? So let me know. I'm not sure, but is this the same part that was used for um, Buster Excalibur, right? Because I remember in the anime it had it, but the Hasbro version didn't have this, but I thought this, it looks like it. So what I used for my Buster Excalibur was the um, Arrow whatever it was called, that came with, uh, what's that guy called? I'm a, I'm a Taratu, I'm a Terio, that one. So let me know if that's like the same thing. All right, so first question, why does Ultimate Reboot need a dash driver for an Infinity Lock system? I'm not complaining because I'm going to use it, but why does it need a dash driver? I'm excited though. All right, so let's weigh these things up. Let's check the weight on this. Comes in at... 26 rams and then compare it to Genesis, which is 27. All right, so pretty much the same. Yeah, 26. Then we have a zero, obviously, plus the dagger. This is called dagger, right? It looks like it's a D on it, so I'm calling it dagger. That looks dope. And then ultimate reboot, dash nine. So then all together, if I can get this thing on here, hold up. There we go, it's on there. 61. So this thing obviously is only supposed to be able to burst when it's like in this mode. Right? Boom, there's the burst. All right, so then, that being the case, how do I do this? There we go. So then if it's over here, it shouldn't be able to burst. Yeah, okay, so this one works a lot better. With Genesis, no matter what, I can just like burst it. So if it's here, just turn it. Oops. Here, I just turn it and then just burst. But I do have to like turn it back the opposite direction. So maybe that's, I don't know, maybe the gimmick works, but I'm definitely gonna try my hardest to burst it. And then also have the Big Bang armor here from Big Bang Genesis, which obviously should fit right on top of Prime Apocalypse and give me Big Bang Apocalypse, which looks super dope. And you should be able to be bursted. Yep, still can burst it. All right, maybe that's just in the cartoon. I don't know. Either way, looks dope. Yeah, let's get this thing off though. All right, let's set this aside, put this back where it's supposed to be on this guy. And then uh, let's see how he acts in the stadium. So put him on big orange. And yeah, I'm excited. I've never had an alternate reboot. So I'm excited to see how this acts. Three, two, one, subscribe to my channel. This reboot activated pretty quickly. All right. So let's see how he does against Dragon Imperial. Activated. Definitely not. Ooh. Stamina loss, but definitely putting some work on Dragon. 
Ooh, all right, so Dragon won that one. So let's put it up against uh, Master Diabolos. Master was too scared and decided to come back. Too late, bruh. Master's just way too uncontrolled in this stadium. Ooh. Master's just way too crazy. Let's switch up stadiums to... Let's go with Starburst. Since Master uh, Devilos is acting too wild in the stadium. All right, let's give it another shot. Launcher jammed up, you saw that? Nice, okay. That was nice. No movement, obviously didn't unlock. All right, let's try to switch a master over to right spin. Yeah, so this guy's definitely getting bodied. So let's put on the Big Bang armor and see if we can redeem some of his, uh, his former glory. So, like, here's my thing, one of my questions about, like, the, the anime. Why is it that all, like, the big villains, right? So let's think about, uh, what's his face? Um, Fi and whatever. Like, Fi was rich. Him and his brother were rich. That was, okay, understandable. But how is Arthur? Like, how does Arthur have money? Enough to have a tower in the middle of, like, Tokyo, right? That no one just, just people just allow to be there. This big, gigantic, dumb looking tower. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Here's some nice hits. But yeah, I just don't think uh, Apocalypse has what it takes. I don't know. I thought Apocalypse would be a lot stronger than this, but he seems to be a pretty weak at bay. Big hits. And when I spoke, I spoke too soon. Apparently, Apocalypse was able to take that one. All right, let's do one more. Let's do uh, Apocalypse versus uh, Lucifer, the end. Definitely giving us some big hits. This is going to be enough. Like it wasted a lot of stamina in the beginning. Uh, looks like a tie. No movement. And obviously Apocalypse is no movement. Let's test this out again. Looks like... Uh, Lucifer's gimmick activated. I think it did anyway. No, it didn't. Okay, I thought it did. Was it? Nope, not even close. All right, last one. Let's see if Apocalypse can do anything. That would have missed launch.
right, so, you know, I'm interested to see, like, if Apocalypse can really do any damage, but, uh, because right now I'm not really seeing it, but maybe, just maybe, I'll see the damage that Apocalypse can deliver. So, with that being said, thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel, like this video, and let me know in the comments below a good battle for Apocalypse and Big Bang Apocalypse, because I would love to see. I just, I just like these little infinite lockers. They're cool. All right, folks. Uh, I'm your host, Michael Nightwing. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you next video. See ya.